guys, it's me Patrick here, and today, I'm going to be proving to you that starfish are smarter than cerebral crustaceans. So let's get started. Right, so for the first example of what makes starfish smarter than cerebral crustaceans, we're going to see how we do with typing on a computer. So, my challenger is Brainstorm. Hello, I am... Brainstorm! And today, I'm going to be showing you how I type my computer. Okay, so I'm going to type my computer up first, then you can do it on, on mine, okay? Sure, I'll watch. So I usually press like this, but first I turn it on by pressing one of these buttons somehow. Okay, your turn now, I don't even know how to use this thing. I'll watch how you do, okay? Sure. In our world, we just use the keys and press them by doing this. Wait, what are you doing? No! Stop it! You're breaking my computer! Whoops. Whoops! Whoops! You broke my computer! And you think whoops is gonna fig is gonna fix things? Y yeah Dude, you're an idiot! If you think you are smart in six gal in six galaxies, actually five. Whatever. L let's just go to a net to another example to show how dumb you are. Okay, okay. But I'm warning you, if this video doesn't turn out good, then this video is gonna have a little payback. Alright? Alright. So for this next challenge, we're going to be pressing the right button that turns on the TV. So, never, 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 never press this little thingy right here. See that right there? I don't want anyone pressing it, okay? So I'm going to go first and show you how the TV is turned on, okay? Alright. Yes, it's working! See? Just like that. Now it's your turn. Right, so let me get this straight. I want you to press any button except for that big button down there. Okay. What are you doing now? What are you doing to my TV? Uh, I'm sorry. You're sorry, eh? I told you not to press that button. Oh, look, I got a little confused. I thought you said the red button. No, I meant that wheel thing button. Oh, yeah, my bad. So, what's our next challenge going to be? I'm going to teach you how to drive, okay? Right, so this is your car over there, isn't it? Yeah, that's my saucer. Unlike any type. Yeah, that's great. Anyway... I'm going to be crossing the road without being run over, okay? Alright. Where's that, rat? Come back here! <laughs> so, how was my driving test? Never again. Anyway, next challenge. The next challenge is that we are going to be collecting the gems. Wait, is this the fourth challenge? Yes it is. Yes it is. And I'm gonna need you to hide one gem in one certain place, okay? Without hurting yourself. Alright. Yeah. So what gem have you got? Uh, I have coronium. Coronium? Yeah, coronium. Well, what are you gonna do with it? Oh, I know. I'm going to put that in my head. Wait, what? Wait, ah! D dude, that's got to hurt. Are you stupid? No. Why have you put that in your head then? I don't know. Anyway, come and collect it. I'm not doing that. Fine. Come back here, you. Uh, b bend over a bit. I need to get the gem out. Hold still. I'm trying. Ah, dude, that's get that's my butt. That get off. Right 
Now for our last challenge, we're going to be revealing our calculus to see who's the smartest. So, on the left is me with 58 million percent calculus, and over here we have Brainstorm who has 5% calculus. So, the winner is me! What? I thought I was smarter! Nope, looks like you're dumb. Arrgh. Well, I'm gonna go and make a card. Oh, come on.